For us, 2019 is still about 12 hours away, and that means there's still plenty of time to figure out how you want to celebrate, whether it's at a home, with friends, or there's no shortage of festivities. And one of the biggest parties happening tonight is downtown Miami. That's where we find CBS4 Carly Barnett. She is live with what you can expect. Carly. Maribel, at this point, it's less than 12 hours until people are going to be ringing in the new year with this guy behind me. He is going to ascend to the top of the Intercontinental Hotel, and they are expecting larger than ever crowds this year and some new sights to see. When the clock strikes midnight, it will mark the official start of 2019. Uh, we just invite everyone down to celebrate with, as we say, the theme this year to rise up rise up with the big orange. Of course, in true Florida fashion, the big orange is the spectacle to see. The 35 foot neon orange will climb 400 feet to the top of the Intercontinental to welcome in the new year. And new this year, the launch party will be at Bayside Marketplace instead of right outside the hotel. That's due to 2,000 additional LED lights on the big orange that will make their debut. Because of the brightness of the big orange, it's really smiling this year. <laughs> Taking the stage is Pitbull to perform his New Year Revolution concert at Bayfront Park, and it's free of charge. A crowd of more than 150,000 people can enjoy the annual fireworks, music, and food. Those who come out every year say feeding a crowd this big is a major undertaking. I'm, I am start to prepare for last night because we have spent a lot of people today, and now I'm working to to work in the morning. Of course, most important is to celebrate safely, and law enforcement will be out to make sure of it. Our officers actually increased and doubled the effort. We're going to have more police personnel present, and we're also going to have uh, many other agencies assisting us as well, and we're also going to have fire rescue and other resources there to be on standby. Well, that celebration tonight starts at 5. It's going to end at midnight. Do keep in mind there will be several road closures to accommodate for all of the people that are going to be here. So to check that out before you head out on the roads, make sure you visit our website, cbsmiami.com. We also have some information there regarding parking and the event itself. But for now, live at Bayfront Park, Carly Barnett, CBS4 News.